Today we're speaking with author, CBS Sunday Morning News correspondent, and bull terrier lover, Martha Teichner, about her wonderful new book, When Harry Met Minnie. It's the touching story of a chance friendship Martha had with a woman named Carol, who was diagnosed with cancer and had to find a home for her dog, Harry. The book chronicles their beautiful friendship, the blossoming love between Harry and Martha's dog, Minnie, and is a reminder of the mysterious ways pets can bring people together. Martha, welcome. And please, we want to hear why you decided to, to bring this wonderful memory of your friends and dogs to the rest of us. Writing the book was a chance for me to re-immerse myself in the story. I was actually looking for an older dog uh, because Minnie was probably the same age as Harry or a little older. What I was looking for was the right companion for Minnie. It all came together because of the encounter at the farmer's market when I ran into her friend Stephen. I mean, you both really needed each other and had that chance meeting. And Stephen told you that his friend Carol was dying of cancer and couldn't find anyone to take in her 11 and a half year old dog, Harry. What if you'd been 15 minutes later? Or what if you didn't go that day? Right. Or, right? I mean, none of it would have happened. It felt like fate. You write about how Harry and Minnie fell in love. What did their relationship look like? Every single bull terrier I've ever had loves mangoes. And of course, Minnie adored mangoes and she taught Harry to like mangoes. It kind of sounds like you're spoiling them, Martha. Um... <laughs> if I can't spoil my dogs, what's life for? <laughs> Everybody would say to me, oh, it's wonderful what you're doing for Carol. But the flip side of that was, wasn't it wonderful what I got by adopting Harry? It was very definitely a two-way street. If I hadn't said yes to all the circumstances and been willing to take Harry on and live with him knowing that Carol was dying and so on, I wouldn't have experienced one of the richest sets of experiences I've had in my whole life. <laughs>